always ignoring the no trespassing signs. <laughs> what are you talking about? We didn't even see him. One of the last things I said to my dad was that I hate you. I just felt like I didn't fit in with my family. It seems like they don't understand why I skateboarded in the first place. Fuck! Becoming a man, and like, I feel like that's something I got fucked over on because like my childhood was a really shitty time. When I got home. I got disciplined. How did you get disciplined? Uh, I mean, well, they call it child abuse now, but it's not really a child. <laughs> um. Bitch! Ugh. I stole something. That was the worst ass whooping I have ever gotten. Afterwards, after my ass stopped stinging, I'm just like, he apologized for, for like beating me. And, like, he totally just explained to me that like, it was just how he was raised. I know that he loved me. Like that's why he was so hard on me. Fucking wrong with you? Throwing your fucking boy at me? Here he held in a lot, and his dad, you know, he was really kind of strict on it. You know, his father was. He was a carpenter, and he wanted Kier to do that because he couldn't get the other boys to, you know, to follow in his footsteps. But Kier didn't like it. Like sometimes I know that I have to work with him, so I would sneak out my window, like throw my boy out first, and just climb out. kept trying to make me work like every single weekend. And I was like, come on, like I gotta skate, I got to skate. And then we got in like a fight. He was like, I'm your dad, like you're going to work. And I was just like, no. And then I moved out like the next day. I was just so fucking angry because he just kicked my ass. like a drug in a way. Like, I could seriously be on the verge of having a fucking mental breakdown, but as long as I'm able to go skate, then I'm completely fine. Oh, I need a fries, please, for the steak sandwich. Here you are, sir. All right, I'll go grab your menu. This is like so much better than being back there and having to do all of that. <laughs> the last time I talked to my dad, I argued and fought with him. I moved out the next day. The last time I came here, it was his funeral. I would love for my dad to see how much progress I've made since I was a little shithead trying to escape it. Maybe he'd just be like, ah, oh, damn. You weren't just wasting your, your life.
I get mad at skateboarding like a lot, but at the end of the day, I, I love it so much I can't stay mad at it. <laughs> but it hurts you. Yeah. So did my dad. But I love him to death.